Hey, you guys. I have decided to jump on the bandwagon of the fabrics of Walmart. Um, you know, Walmart has a little thing, a little um, basket where they're put like already pre-cut fabrics. You can get like two yards, three yards, four yards for like a really good price. Now, this is uh, two yards and it's only four dollars. And it's I guess it's like a stretchy jersey type material. But it's two yards for four bucks. And this color is um, black. I also picked up two yards of this and it has like the floral print. And I would say this is like a jersey stretchy feel also for four bucks. And then I got this color also. It's like a blue floral, same thing, two yards, $4. And I picked up this one. I was excited to get this one. It's like a jean, um, like a jean material is two yards and it was four dollars i was looking forward to probably be like eight bucks and i saw where somebody else posted when they got this um fabric right here theirs had like some white stuff on the inside i don't think mine has it at least it didn't don't feel like it does which no it doesn't but um i saw they did a post in like the facebook um fabrics of walmart or walmart fabrics they have a group on facebook and she put hers up and it had like a white backing on it um thank goodness mine don't have it but her material looks so much similar to mine it was like a jean material but it had like a white htv like backing on it. i don't know if somebody ironed it on the back or or what the fabric was supposed to be used for or anything but i do know it was like a jean um like a jean print like this and i had just went to um where did i go was it hobby lobby yeah it was hobby lobby i went to hobby lobby and i got some jean material also i think i got like a yard or a half a yard or something like that and then i got three yards of another material because the um project i'm going for i have to have three yards of fabric so i don't know how i'm gonna do it yet it's like a little um it's like a little duster um it looks thin like i mean you can make it out of whatever kind of fabric you want to make it out of but it should it seems like it should be like out of some like flimsy kind of like um airy material um and i found like a I guess if I'm saying it right, like a chambray, chambray type fabric. And it had like the little polka dots on. Then I had some with the lines on it, but I just got the polka dot one. And then I just got the plain chambray one. And luckily I found, like I said, two yards of this in Walmart for only four bucks. So, and this was the only one they had. So I did grab this one. So I will say I lucked out on this. And I had some other fabrics too that I got from Walmart. I got a couple of rolls of the 100% polyester, just the white um, kind, because I plan on just designing that and decorating it however I want to, using the sublimation ink. Um, I haven't played around with it yet. I just have it stuffed away with all my other fabrics. But I had been buying any of the fabrics in yards. I normally just be buying the, um, what do you call them? The, um, <laughs> dang, the 18 by 21 fat quarters i normally been buying just the fat quarters um and just making like little small stuff but um i actually want to get into like sewing some clothes for my little girl and then like some things for me maybe like some shirts i'm not talking like big time stuff or nothing like that but i do want to make me some linen pants and i want it to be like a jean material or like the chambray um kind of material I do want to do that um, and I'm gonna do it like I said I have my machine over there I have my surgeon have my sewing slash embroidery machine but I do want to get a standalone embroidery machine and also a standalone sewing machine you know separate I want to mix together um, I haven't decided which name brand I want yet right now I have a brother sewing embroidery machine then I have a genome serger um, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do as far as the sewing machine. Oh, but I know 
I guess I'm saying it right, Havana, Havaska, whatever. They have really good name brand machines. Um, I look at some at Joann's. And when I tell you they are high dollar machines, because I was looking at the Sapphire, and that thing is like seven, eight thousand dollars. And then they got the Epic Two. I saw that that's coming out, and that's like a eight thousand dollar machine. Um, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'll figure something out, but I'm not really worried about as far as the price because you can always do credit. I just need room i don't have room for all these kind of machines and i have like the cricket machine i want the glow forge um and i don't have room for this stuff but i want it <laughs> um but um i need my own space so yeah i just wanted to show you guys my fabric haul from walmart you can't beat this these yards for four dollars because when i went to hobby lobby they had their material on sale i think it was like 35%, maybe 45%, maybe 25 or 35% off of the yards. So even just getting three yards, I think I spent like, um, it might have been $14 or so for the, the three yards that I got. Um, but it just depends on how much the a yard costs. Um, so yeah, um, check out your local Walmarts, y'all, because you can get some nice fabric cuts already cut two yards i've seen as much as four yards in there and it depends on like the material some of it is eight dollars i have gotten some that's two dollars all these were four dollars um so just check your local walmart's if you're in need for some fabric for cheap and as always thank you guys for watching and be blessed